two days of relative quiet in Syria's Aleppo. That's what Russia and the U.S., who support rival sides in the civil war, agreed to on Tuesday by extending the so-called regime of calm for another 48 hours. But the people who live here have seen it all before. Ceasefires are broken almost as soon as they're agreed. And this latest cessation of hostilities doesn't include Islamist groups like Islamic State or the Nusra Front. What we're hoping for is a complete resolution, so we'll be rid of these armed gangs. Honestly, the ceasefire is a lie. The situation in Aleppo will only be resolved militarily. No such thing as a ceasefire in neighboring Idlib province bordering Turkey. At least 10 people were reported killed in airstrikes on the town of Binish. It's unclear if the strikes came from Syrian or Russian aircraft. The U.S. says the next international push for peace talks will come next week. But for those caught in the crossfire, talk that turns into real action can't come soon enough.